This is Game Mess Jeopardy! Introducing today's contestants. Everybody put your hands together for the conqueror of Bubsy 3D, Jeff Grubb! And watch out everyone, because Mitch is in this bitch, it's Mike Minotti! It's a beautiful, 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 beautiful! Nice to see your mansions on Friday night. Happy Friday night, Mitch, 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 Mitch. Good to see you, baby, it's a Friday night. You're fucking and I'll never tell you, baby. And in the blue corner, weighing 186 pounds, the undefeated game as Jeopardy champion of the world, the dancing destroyer, the king of stain, the count of Monte Fisto, the master of disaster, the number one gamer on Cameo, the one, the only, Dan Riker! Back to defend my crown, undefeated you never here won. on Game Mess Jeopardy. <laughs> you I'm never ready won. to go again. The Jade Cargill of Game Mess Jeopardy is what they call <laughs> okay. me. Here okay. we go. Let's and of course, I am your host for the evening, Sean Turbo, Sean McDowell. And we have a giant show lined up for everyone because it is the season two premiere of Game as Jeopardy. It, this season, I can't wait. It's going to be bigger. It's going to be better. It's going to be too much for Mr. Incredible. And I can't wait to show y'all. Oh, we like have lined up this year. Thought you'd like that one, Mike. I do. But before we get to any of that, contestants, how are you all doing this evening? I'm great. Never been better. Never been better. Yes, this is the best day of my life, and I expect it to only get better. Excellent, excellent. Uh, Dan, Mitch, special answer guest. Answer the question, Mitch. <laughs> Look, I'm on a losing streak. I don't know. I don't know how I feel. I don't know how I feel. I, I used to be the king of this game, and it uh, hasn't been going my way lately. I've been That's right. The streak having some continues. I've been having some embarrassing We're both from me winning every month to Mike losing every month, but the streak lives. Mm. This is all right, chaos. <laughs> this brings this up a good perfect. point. It's fantastic. <laughs> Dan over there, special guest for the evening. Welcome back to the show. It's uh, you, you're the you're the first. Uh, let me let me see if this math is right. The first returning guest to. Uh, oh no, wait, you're you're the champion of the world. You have one, of course. Uh, no, yes. well, I've only one. Just just not. He's true. only one. That's correct. That's it's correct. just lies. Uh, let's, let's fact checking. Uh, K fave yeah, is not no, a thing right. in game. Right. Jeopardy. Prove it. Prove it. You can't prove it. Yes, we can. It's on YouTube. <laughs> Give me see what AI can do these days. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's all deep fakes. They don't yeah, know what's going on. Right. Anyway, right here. Dan, how are you feeling about the game tonight? I confident isn't a strong enough word. I don't think there is a word for how I feel right now. Fair enough. Fair enough. I like it's it. It's a good like feeling. It. You Mike, know Ben Hansen won. He did. You probably gave him a bunch of fucking Pokemon Snap questions or something. <laughs> I should have done that. That would made for an Ian Bear show. Mm. Uh, Mike, gaming podcast questions. <laughs> you have lost your confidence over there, buddy. Are you doing yes. all right? Are no, you... no, you're not. No. Okay, we he almost we didn't need... show up tonight. <laughs> I <laughs> know he was running scared, man. <laughs> Taking Penny out or whatever. I was sleeping. I was <laughs> sleepy. That's <laughs> time it is. That makes sense. Oh yeah, I took a really early nap. I mean, have you met Mike? Like, <laughs> not in person. I mean, he could be a deep nah. fake. That's true. That's true. I never yeah. thought about that. <laughs> have a figment of your imagination. Yeah. <laughs> the AI is is like destroying itself to create Mike Minotti. I think. Yeah. <laughs> so you're not feeling great, Mike. You don't, you no. don't think you can take these guys down? No. Nah. Okay. Very difficult. Now I'll lose right. again, but we'll see. You hear? You heard it here first, everyone. Spoiler for the episode, Jeff. Are you, are you feeling more confident than Mike? Yes, without a doubt. Yeah. I mean, that doesn't mean okay. anything. It's never meant anything. But yes, I am. Okay, but are you feeling more confident than Dan? That's a real question. I don't think I've ever felt more confident than Dan ever. Dan doesn't know that it like, it, but it's not. Some mm. things aren't possible. So no, I know for mm -hmm. for, for sure I'm not feeling as confident. It's as a that. good quality. It helps you in life. I, yeah, yeah, I don't disagree. Try it. I should try I'll, it. I'm I like the optimism personally. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I'll try it and I'll immediately get hit by a train somehow. But <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> if you didn't get hit while you're in the gizmo costume, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> good point. You're right. I'm, in, I I'm indestructible now. You. I was seeing what you were made of and you yes. passed the test. You test my, <laughs> my metal. Sure. Yeah. Yes. Okay, well, on the off chance this is anyone's first time watching this show, hi, welcome. This is what it's like every month. <laughs> we have a good time here on Game S Jeopardy, and normally we would premiere this uh, exclusively for our patrons, but this month, hey, we thought we'd let everyone see what the show's all about. It's the season two premiere. We want to get everyone in here. We got Dan. It's going to be a good show. So I hope you all are buckled in for a good ride. Game as Jeopardy. We basically just follow the rules of Jeopardy. If you've seen Jeopardy, you know what that's all about. And if you don't, well, let me go over 
it for you real quick here. Uh, I'm going to give the contestants a board with questions on them, clues if you will. They simply need to buzz in with the correct answer before any of their opponents and at the end of the game have a higher score than anyone else. And of course they need to answer in the form of a question. I would like to remind all the contestants of that tonight. I won't be too hard on you, but I will make you look like a bit of a dope if you don't answer uh, in the form of a question. I think that's hard Anyways. for me because I have not seen Jeopardy, so it's like I know I, uh, my brain <laughs> isn't used to that. The last time you were here, I believe you told me that your frame of reference for Jeopardy was a celebrity Jeopardy and second percent back mostly. So hundred percent, yes. All right. For example, excellent, like I excellent. love game shows, but I think I never watched Jeopardy because it was about like knowledge and not bullshit mm. and spinning wheels it's usually, and stuff. Yeah, it's usually yeah. nerdy crap that no yeah. one cares about. Right, but here, right. no, we're not nerds. We like video games. This is the stuff yeah. that matters in life. Yeah. No one had to run an obstacle course where they got hit in the dick on Jeopardy. So <laughs> That's yeah, exactly. shows, unfortunately, yeah. <laughs> Excellent. All right. Well, to start off, we are starting fresh here in season two. Uh, normally, the returning champion cannot pick first, but hey, since everyone's starting with clean slates, I've used RNG to determine who will be picking first. And hey, Jeff, that's the cool thing about rolling a die. I can do that. Okay. And RNGesus right. has chosen to bless. Wouldn't you know it? It is Jeff Grubb yeah, with I love the first die. pick. All right. Is Hell it yeah. dice RNG? I never thought of it that way. Well, what do you mean? Never thought of it. That technically, way. it's not because it all depends on how he throws it, and physics is predetermined. We can get sure. into it later. So yeah, but don't I guess worry it's about kind it. of the same idea of like Maybe there's we're no just such thing as number. randomness. Yeah, yeah, okay, totally. Yeah, wow. Yeah, dice it's almost like RNG. it's where it came from is replicating the rolling dice in RPGs. Really? That doesn't yeah. sound right. Oh no shit. Okay. Yeah, well. All right. So I'm looking at the board once you bring it up, right? And then I uh... and once I bring it up, Jeff will be picking the first clue from the following six categories. We have. Xbox, PlayStation, and Nintendo, as we do most months. After that, we have an audio category in Who Said It? I'm going to play a short audio clip of a character talking in a video game. You need to tell me which character said the voice line, Michael. And yes, after yes. that, we have UIC. This is my own category that I love to put in every month where I'm going to show you a picture, a screenshot mm. from a game, but everything is blanked out except for the UI. Based purely on the UI of the game, you need to tell me which game it is. And last but not least, we have Roland, Roland, Roland. If you've seen Jeopardy, you know what this is all about, the quotes there. Let's Every let's answer. Get... I was just thinking of The Undertaker. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have Roll. <laughs> As part of the answer. Right, because roll in is in full quotes there. Right, okay, Rolls I get in it. full quotes. So roll in some form will be important to every answer. All right, I already that have like said, three answers for that. Let's go. Jeff, where would you like to go first? Uh, yeah, let's go rolling for 100. All righty. Also familiar to Katamari Damacy fans, this term is often used by RPG players when they make or change their main character. That's going to Jeff. What is re-roll? It is re-roll. Very nice. It's, right. uh, it's all over for you, boys. Let's go rolling for 200. This gaming technology helps reduce input lag and eliminate slowdown in online matches for players with poor internet connections. That Shit. will be Mike. What is rollback net code? Very nicely done, yes. Well, I'll take rolling for 300. All right, let's keep it rolling. In the second generation of Pokemon games, Whitney's infamous Miltank used this rock type move to send many trainers scurrying back to the Pokemon Center. Mike. What is roll out? That's correct. Dan, did you really know that one? No, I was going to guess rock and roll. Uh, yeah, me no. too, actually, but I'm okay. going to buzz in. I didn't have the guts. <laughs> yes. Roll in for 400. A famous music track in Daytona, USA starts with this lyric, which describes the beginning of a race. Shit. That one will be Mike. Fuck. What is Rolling Stone? <laughs> I was jamming on that button. Excellent, excellent. I'm lightheaded. Hang it. on, hang on, hold on. Okay, <laughs> all right, now I'm good. Uh, roll in for 500. Sharing its name with a protective frame of a race car, this Cygnosis developed racing game allowed players to drive on walls and even ceilings at high speeds. That'll be Jeff. What is Roll Cage? It is Roll Cage, yes. I don't think my buzzer works. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just right, you, no, you did that well, whole category 
and no references to roll for Mega Man, and no and no <laughs> references to Dylan's Rolling West. Isn't that a game? <laughs> yeah, that is mm. a game. Nintendo, uh, yeah. Interesting, isn't that? Mm. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. All right. Um, Dan, what's your strategy for for buzzing in? Are you uh, doing? I'm mouse doing the thing you told me. I think you sabotaged me. I got the browser window open for my mouse, and I got my keyboard. So I'm hitting space and clicking the thing. That's the, the thing like to do. Whenever That's what I'm just mashing in fast. It's or? not fast enough. I mean, it's really, not, it's almost a light touch on the key on the space bar. You're just kind of like almost. You're barely tapping it because you don't want to hold it in because I think that might cancel it out. Speed running. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's go with UIC for 100, please. All righty, gentlemen. Name that game. Dan. Tomb Raider. What is Tomb Raider? What is Tomb Raider? Yes. Save yourself there. Nice. <laughs> <That's God>. Tomb <laughs> Raider. <what> <laughs> <laughs> uh, UIC for 200, please. All righty. Name that game. Mike. Fuck. What is Mass Effect? It is Mass Effect. All right. Shepard. Uh, <laughs> UIC for 300. Name that game. That'll be <laughs> Jeff. What the fuck? What is Mike Tyson's punch out? You never that heard that correct. game before me. <laughs> 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 Don't you disrespect Grubber Lang like that? Yeah, Come on right. now. I invented Grubber Lang. I <laughs> 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 uh, let's I go to UIC this world. for 400. <laughs> God damn it. Name that game. Jeff. Fucking. What is F0X? Yes, F0X on the N64. Very nice. Uh, let's go with UIC for 500. Okay. Name that game. Oh, I recognize this. Dan? What is, that? What is Top Gun for NES? Incorrect. Fuck. One time I get in. <laughs> if no one else wants to try, I'm locking that one. That is a- Rally X. Wow, okay. The Man. arcade classic. Uh, fun little fact there, that's where the, the little flag you see in some Namco games like Star Fox Assault and Super Smash Brothers Ultimate oh, comes wow. from. Yeah. Oh, wow. I assume it was from yeah. flag position or whatever, the pole position. Pole but position. Oh, okay. mm-hmm. Yep, it's this one. Flag position. <laughs> uh, my, it's still my call, right? I lost uh, points? Yeah, yeah. Yep. you're negative. Yep. Fuck! You, you, Wait, you, I actually you, told me about this exact thing before we started. Shit. Yep. <laughs> Fuck! Uh, I forgot do immediately. I have yeah, uh, you're gonna right, send go. us uh, four hundred dollars if you don't make that back. Fuck. <laughs> Nintendo for one hundred. I'll do a bit goal to pay you back. There you go. <laughs> the Alien Wars is the Western subtitle for this Super Nintendo game. That will be Mike. God. <laughs> what is Contra Three? It is Contra 3. Almost, almost said Castlevania 3 is a stupid little slip up there. Uh, <laughs> Nintendo for 200, please. It was the name for the television-based service on the Wii U that helped users find where to watch their favorite shows. Jeff. Uh, what is... Oh, shit. Uh, what, what is TV, like with two eyes? Yes, it is TV. <laughs> oh, man. I can't believe <laughs> I pulled very that out of my ass. There. I have no memory of that, that, but I thought, I bet it was just TV. That sounds like what they would have called it. (laughs) That's a hell of a question, Sean. Uh, Nintendo for 300. (laughs) That is a Daily Double. (laughs) Thank God I didn't get the Daily Double. Nobody buzz in. Uh, I'd like to go for 1,500. You're not allowed to get it, Dan. Jeff is going all in. 1,500 on the Wait, do we lose 1,500? Oh, God. No, you're no, not. Only, only Jeff, Jeff is these. answering oh, here. Only Jeff it's does the daily first daily. name of Fox McCloud's father. Shit. I, what is Star? I don't know. <laughs> star McCloud. Correct. <laughs> uh, do either Dan or Mike know? Can I? Bu- do I have to buzz in or do I? No, you, no, no just, just for fun. Just, just for fun. James? It is James McCloud. Damn, if you had watched my Star Fox series playthrough on oh twitch.tv slash Turbo cool. Sean Jeff, you I would get, know well, that. And I get guilted. All right, I mean, cool. He, of he's also an F0X, so. That's true. All right, well, now I'm back at zero, so here we go. Oh, good. Uh, I like that. What do you pick next, Jeff? Yeah, let's go Nintendo for 400, please. The Nintendo e-reader was originally intended to only work with this franchise. Functionality was pivoted to include most popular Nintendo franchises at the time, pre-release. That will be Jeff. Guess, but what is Animal Crossing? Incorrect. 
That will be going to Dan next. What is Pokemon? Of course, Pokemon cards. Oh, okay. It was originally oh, going to be cool. the we Pokemon card e-reader, and then the card e-reader, and then they just shortened it to e-reader. It was complicated. Nah. And then they had a Mario yeah. Party with e-reader cards, and Super Mario sure Advance did. had like the they items sure and did. stuff. I need to buy an yep. e-reader. All right. <laughs> Wouldn't e-reader Damn, work with an nice. analog pocket? Okay, anyway, uh, Nintendo for 500 <laughs> Long before Persona 5 or Soul Hackers 2, this Virtual Boy exclusive was the first entry in the Megami Tensei series to be released outside Japan. Mm. Jeff? What is Jack Bros? Jack Brothers, but I'll take that. No, yeah, don't I... take it. Don't take it. <laughs> uh, let's go uh, PlayStation for 100. Okay. This PlayStation exclusive golf series has had a wide variety of guest characters, including Kratos, Gex, and even real golfer John Daly. Can I remember it? Dan? What is Hot Shots Golf? Yeah. That is correct. Hot Shots yeah. Golf for everybody's golf. Oh, if I would have said everybody's golf, I would have got it. I'm like, I could remember everybody's Same golf. Series. Yeah. Same series. Damn it. Uh, PlayStation for 200, please. Okay. Controversy arose surrounding this PS3 game when E3 2005 trailer made to look like gameplay with incredible graphics was actually a pre-rendered concept video. And Mike slipped in there. Fuck! What is Killzone 2? Killzone 2 is correct. Right. Very nice. PlayStation for 300. Likely a bit of cross-marketing, Cloud Strife found his way as a guest character into this PlayStation-exclusive Square RPG less than five months after FF7's Japanese release. Mike? What is Final Fantasy Tactics? Good old Final Fantasy Tic Tacs. Right. Uh, PlayStation for 400. This series of Namco light gun peripherals started with the first one being bundled with the PS1 version of Time Crisis. Dan? What is the gun con? That is correct. Nice. Good one. PlayStation for 500. I got one sitting over there. The third numbered entry in this Square Tactical RPG series launched exclusively on the PS1 and was the first in the series to be released in the West. Jeff. What is Tactics Ogre? Incorrect. Damn it. Mm. Mike? What is Front Mission? It is Front Mission. Very nicely done. Good job. Uh, who said it for 100? All right, listen closely. Tell me which character said this line. I don't need a weapon. My friends are my power. <laughs> Mike? They don't even know that. <laughs> Sora from Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> of course it's Sora. That is a real line said by Sora in that very real game. Yes. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, who said it for 200? Where's everyone going? Bingo? Fuck. Dan. Who is Leon Kennedy? That is absolutely correct. Very good. Who set up for 300? Shit, they're going to mess up my fucking tomatoes! <laughs> Dan. <laughs> Who is Marcus Phoenix? Tomato yes, I believe you uh, played through that not too long ago. Eh? Yes, and I love that line. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who set up for 400? Raguye Scott in Pache. Mike. Who is uh, Ezio? Yes, Ezio Auditorio. Oh, good. Yep. Does that way you gonna... kill someone important in air quotes? <laughs> yeah. Or in when you finish a match in Soul Calibur 5, I believe. Uh, oh, yes. yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Uh, who said it for 500? The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. Dan. Who is the G-Man? Absolutely. Nailed it. Got that voice rules. We will move to Xbox for 100. Okay. This former Xbox executive famously excited crowds for Halo 2 and Grand Theft Auto 4 by tattooing their logos on his arms. God damn it. Mike. Who's Peter Moore? Correct. Those were, he was kayfabe and those were working tattoos. (laughs) (laughs) Xbox for 200. Microsoft put a bow on Xbox Live Arcade's OG Xbox launch by including a free copy of this game on every startup disc. Damn. Oh, Come on. What is Miss Pac-Man? They put a bow on it with uh, Miss Pac-Man. Oh, I, was I almost said Hexic HD, but that was 360. Yep. 
That's Xbox right. for 300 This spirally developer burst onto the XBLA scene by putting out both The Maw and Splosion Man in 2009. Fuck, fuck, what is their name? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh my God. Jeff? What is Twisted Pixel? Yes. Yes, Twisted wow. Pixel. Is it the one with the talking car, loco cycle, or whatever? Yeah, yeah. right. <laughs> uh, 400, please. The original Xbox and the Xbox 360 both used a modified version of this operating system as the basis for their system softwares. Mike is just like, nope, I ain't even touching this one after the one with Nick. <laughs> Jeff. What is Windows? Go on. Um, <laughs> all right. What What is Windows NT? Incorrect. I believe that's what you guessed last time. We had a question yeah. like that, too. Well, yeah, definitely. Was... And... Dan? Gotta be right eventually. What is... Windows, um, well, I had a thing I was going to say, but then I got uh, M-E? Incorrect. I believe that's what Mike <laughs> guessed. Mike said after I said. <laughs> oh, God. And Mike's just out, so we're locking down I don't think that it's one. what I wanted to say. <laughs> I made this one a little easier if you were thinking about the time period. It's just Windows 2000. 2000 is what I was going to say. Edition. Uh-huh. That's what I was thinking of. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is that the same thing? M-E in 2000? No, it's not. It's no, no... two different ones. God damn it. You're thinking of C-E. All right. Oh, okay. The final clue in the Jeopardy round is the original Xbox dashboard featured distorted sounds from this government agency's public domain library. The men that in black. One is gone. No, it's a little simpler than that. It's just NASA. Oh, okay. okay. Garbled space Didn't sounds and one that. All right, they have a public domain yeah. library, right? It's a public domain organization. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, well, we have an interesting game here. Uh, Jeff is in the hole at 9 I don't think it's interesting. (laughs) Dan is in second place on the board, about halfway between them with 1,300. And then Mike is a commanding lead at 2,700. Very nice. So we will be hanging (laughs) into the double Jeopardy round right after this. Okay, here we are in the double Jeopardy round. Jeff, since you are in third place right now, you do get to pick first from these six (laughs) categories. We have playable rosters in which I'm going to give you a release year and a set of playable characters in a game. You simply need to tell me which game I'm talking about. Then is my favorite category. Name that tune. I'm going to play a 15-ish second clip of a song from a game. You need to tell me what game that version of that song originally appeared in. Just keep that in mind. Then there's box art blank out, which is similar to UIC, but with box arts. I'm going to show you a box art and the logo is blanked out. Just need to tell me what game that is. Then, of course, we have keep them doggies rolling, which <laughs> is overflow from the roll category nice. in the first round. <laughs> then we have space, a category all about space, outer space. And of course, final frontiers, which is going to be all about Ending levels, post-game Ooh. content, adjacent Great. stuff in video games. So, nice. with that being said, Jeff, where would you like to go first? Let's go with Keep Them Doggies Rolling for 200. Okay. In the Star Fox series, when Fox follows Peppy's advice to door barrel roll, he actually performs this aerial maneuver. It's not a barrel roll. <laughs> What is that? That's the only thing I know. Tell, about tell me from. you don't watch uh, game old game theory without telling me you don't watch old game theory. It is an theory. aileron roll. All right, oh, okay. that's a hundred. <laughs> just saw <laughs> that word somewhere. Yeah, get ready. <laughs> All right, <laughs> Jeff. Uh, keep them doggies rolling for four hundred. Okay, the third entry in this Namco Run and Gun series was a Sega Genesis exclusive. And that one is Locked Mike. Come on now. I'm thinking. Rolling Thunder. Oh, yeah. I should have known. Okay. Right. Yeah. Jeff. Uh, keep them dogs rolling for 600. <laughs> this early Nintendo DS game turned a classic gaming icon into a ball that was controlled by rapidly flicking the stylus in the direction the player wanted to move. Dan. What is Kirby Canvas Curse? Incorrect. No! Nope. Oh, and God. that is, what is it? locked. It is pack and pack roll. And roll. Oh, man. I knew, I, no one cares I knew, about that. Kirby, <laughs> Kirby, 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 Kirby,
Um, <laughs> keep going. Yeah. This same category for eight hundred. We're gonna get it's one. It's going very well. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's going great. <laughs> it's the full name of Mega Man's best friend and Mega Man Legends, who helps him along his journey by developing new weapons and equipment. Mike, it was Roll Casket. Yes. Very yeah. Nice oh my God. Okay. And there it is. Ah, uh, keep them doggies rolling. One thousand. That's a daily double. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, you were scared about getting this. I don't like a coward. Yeah. Uh, I got it nicely. We'll do 500. 500. All right. 500 is on the it's line. A thousand here. point question. Yeah. She's gonna, <laughs> about That's to say something crude. And me to you, Jeff, and that I controlled myself. Oh, <laughs> the Damn, second entry in 2K's long running series of wrestling games, WWS SmackDown 2, features this subtitle. Yeah. Uh, it's. So the SmackDown, uh, no SmackDown it has to have roll in it. Uh, God. Oh, no, up, know Dan. your roll. Okay, I was gonna say, are you fucking with me? <laughs> it is no. know your roll. Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> That's funny. All right, I'm sure from Rudy Poo. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. Uh, I'll take um, Boxer Blink out for two hundred. All righty, gentlemen. Name that game. That's going to Jeff. What is Mega Man? Uh, okay. me, wait, 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 I'm sorry, what, what is Mega Man 2? Incorrect. Oh, come on. I'll go to Dan next. Oh, is that... What is Mega Man 9? Yeah. Nice. God damn nice it. Dan. That is correct. Yes. There we wow. go. I have so and much more for anyone, Dan. <laughs> Before anyone in the comments says anything, this was made into a physical box for the press. It was. So it is a box. Art. It was. I seen it. Rules. And rules. All right. All right, Dan, uh, where to? Box art blank out for a thousand. Whoa, whoa. Oh, geez. Let's go. Gentlemen, name that game. Shit. Dan? What is Super Mario Brothers 2 USA? Incorrect. What the Jeff? fuck? What is Super Mario USA? Super Mario USA the is the exact title the of that game. You said two. <laughs> it's not two. What it's just called it Super two? Mario USA. They don't. There is a Super Mario Brothers two in Japan. Moving but it's on. The same game, right? <laughs> that's not. But the that's name not of the it. box. That's not the name of the game. Oh, that's a horseshit. Keep in mind, right. I said oh, you no. need to give me now the name of, of the game. Turbo Shine's rules. No. Oh. <laughs> Turbo Shine's rules are always good and fair. We always trust each other. <laughs> are you throwing turnips? Are you beating warts? That's Mario two. I seen it. Yeah. Box art Blake out for four hundred, please. Fuck. All right. Name that game. Jeff. What is Forza Horizon 4? Yes. Well, wow. context clue there. Xbox yes. One exclusive. It's all about seasons. Yep. It's there they are. Seasons. I can see them. Yeah. That's actually what I used. That's yeah. It. yeah. <laughs> um, box art blank out for 600, please. Name that game. Damn it. Oh, wait a second. Jeff. What? What is Phalanx? It's Phalanx. I like that box. That. Yeah, <laughs> it's the best. I'm actually so going to get that framed, actually. I love it. Uh, box art blank out for 800. Okay. Name that game if you dare. Oh, no. It's not that <sighs> one. Mike? What is Kingdom Hearts 358 <laughs> days over two? You were. On the right track, but that's incorrect. <laughs> Damn it! I just couldn't not guess. <laughs> Jeff, <laughs> what is Kingdom Hearts three hundred fifty-eight over two days? Incorrect. Shit! That's what actually, is you, you got the orders right there. What is Tetris? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm I'm locking that one. It is Kingdom Hearts three five eight days over two? How do you not know that? Come oh, on, so fuck. simple. I, I I'm actually shocked I got the three five eight part right. All right, I, 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 when you said, you said three five, I knew it was eight, and then I was like, I thought you had it, but I don't know. Honestly, I don't know what's the difference between what you said and what he said. So, <laughs> all right. Anyways, <laughs> is it my my, my turn? Yes. Should be. Wait, who got phalanx? I no, did. Jeff got phalanx. Jeff yeah. got phalanx. Yes. And okay. Forza, so playable rosters for two hundred. Okay, uh, 2003 and 4, Blue Alistair Dante. That one is gone. I put 2004 in there as well because those are all playable characters in 
The PS2 version oh, of Beautiful Joe. Okay. Oh my nice. god, that threw okay. me off. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Jeff? Playable rosters for 400. 2021 Sonic Cosmo Kiryu Hello Kitty. Jeff. What is Sonic Team Racing? Incorrect. Yeah, Dan. Shit. What is Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing? Incorrect. It's definitely not. The fuck. And if Mike doesn't want to try Locking that one, no way. which is uh, kind of funny, hmm. because Mike reviewed this game. Oh. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. That's right. The okay. 2021 I wasn't paying attention to. God damn it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You could be a Game Gear in that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, playable <laughs> rosters for 600. <laughs> 2017, Noctis, Lucis Kylum, The Walking Dead's Negan, and Polish Prime Minister Lydia Sobieska. Dan. What is Tekken 7? That is correct. That's right. Negan was and in Dan Tekken 7. Out of That's the right. Hole. Yeah, very weird, right? Is that <laughs> Sam Porter Bridges or is that a different guy? That's him. Uh, yeah. No, it's not Sam Porter no? Bridges. Guy. Oh, he's not in that? Okay. Uh, no, that's not Norman rosters. Fetus and the Dank Fetus. <laughs> yeah. Playable rosters for 800. That is a daily double. Can I only do 100? No, you can do up to the max on the board, so you can do up to 1,000. That. <laughs> okay, Dan is putting a thousand on the line. Twenty eleven, Ratchet, Clank, Captain Quark, Doctor Nefarious. This is such a I'm clicking. Oh wait, oh I, I don't need to click. <laughs> no, nope, it's just you. It's just you. <laughs> I thought you were deep on the It's not turning green. It's not turning green. Um what is PlayStation All Stars Battle Royale? Fuck. That is incorrect. What the Whoa. fuck? Yes, yes. Mike, I know, do you it. know it. Yeah, that's Ratchet and Clank all for one. Yes, oh. all for one. That that's bad, right. The bad, one of the I rare. That was um, answer, Dan. That's Thank what I was going to say. Yeah, you both oh. are dumb. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> but no one liked <laughs> that Eagle, game. Uh, Eagle Eye viewers might notice that I uh, broke my usual rule. I put four characters in there, which may have been a little bit of a clue. Mm. Damn it. You guys even oh, remember right. that game? Because no one liked it. No. Yeah, it's a PlayStation right. 3 joint. Which yeah. is exactly why it I sounded it in good. here as a daily double. Uh, Dan, Anyways, yours. Dan, where would you like to go? Playable roster is 1,000. All right. 2007, Makaya, Elincia, Ike. Mike. What is Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn? That is correct. Wow. Jeez. Very good. Not the, yeah. 2007 helps because just wasn't sure if it's the GameCube or Wii one, but that's the Wii and, one. And uh, wow. Makaya is only in Radiant Dawn. Yeah, well, of course. I mean, we all know that. Um, <laughs> how about uh, space for 200? These celestial beings who made their debut in Super Mario Galaxy can often be seen accompanying their adoptive mother, Rosalina. That'll be Dan. What are Luma? That's correct. Uh, name that tune for a thousand. Wow. All right, everybody, listen closely. Tell me what game this song is from. Mike? Yeah, I hope oh you can hear this, but I like the song a lot. Oh my. Okay, we get it. Uh, this motherfucker. Uh, okay, we get it. All right. Well, that was the wrong note there. Nice, that's nice, from Mirror's nice. Edge. That song is it, also it is called Still fact, Alive. Jesus. From Mirror's Edge. Yes. I all love that song. Horrible. I was like, did it go into a weird, like, orchestral Yeah, did they thing? do a weird. Yeah. That's, <laughs> that is actually the better song named Still Alive from a video game in the year 2007. That's Come true, at huh? me. That's true. Uh, Mike, where to? Space for 400. After 12 years of development and over $500 million raised through crowdfunding, this space sandbox game will surely receive its full release any day now. What is it called? I can't remember what it's called either. Mike? What, what is Star Citizen? That's it. That is correct, God yes. damn it. Um, oh. Final Frontiers for 200. Okay. This famous FPS ditched the idea of having a final boss and said ended the game on a warthog run. Dan. What is Halo Combat Evolved? That's correct. And Halo 3 also would have been eligible for that. How about that? I will do Name That Tune for 800. All right. Listen closely. I got a 
stop picking this category. <laughs> and that one is going to Jeff. Uh, what is Hi-Fi Rush? That is correct. That was my oh. guess, dang it. Nice. I usually go I, older, but I thought I'd throw you a curveball. With yeah, a I, was, I, mean, I, I definitely wasn't certain, but I had to make a play at some point. There's no chance, oh. really, but still, why not? Very good, very good. Uh, let's go uh, Final Frontiers for 400. All right. This RPG sequel released in 2000 is famous for featuring the entire world of the first entry in the series as an explorable post-game reward for players. That will be Mike. What is Pokemon Gold and Silver? That's correct. That's pretty cool. It was cool. I ruled. Final Frontiers for 600. The final portion of this 1997 game has players chasing after the primary villain to stop them from unleashing the game's titular satellite weapon. Dan. What is GoldenEye 007? That's correct. Oh, oh that's right. All the hole again. Very nice. Hell yeah. Uh, let's go uh, Final Frontiers for 800. Okay. In this game, the infamous final mission, End of the Line, involves a high-speed chase with the main antagonist in a fire truck. Didn't... That is going, going, gone. That would be Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Oh, wow. Uh -oh. Those games are bad. I don't wow. <laughs> what? No, I don't really think that. But. Okay, <laughs> Final Frontier for a thousand. <laughs> Many people dislike this final level of Super Mario Sunshine due to its centering around an awkward feeling boat ride. I mean, I know and what I thought. That one know the name. is. I know the fucking. Oh. Gone. It's a uh, it Corona Mountain. Oh, Corona. Hell yeah. It could be that. I thought it was like the name of like the shine or the level or something. Shit. Of course. Right. Corona, Corona Mountain. Mount, uh, that's right. <laughs> you can give me the results. It's fine. We all laughed <laughs> when the <laughs> pandemic happened. That's right. Let's do space uh, for 600. Okay. If it's still even my thing. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it is. Okay. This time loop centric space adventure game is named very similarly to an obsidian RPG. Jeff. Damn. Um, God damn it. Hang on. What is <laughs> Outer Wilds? Damn it. Or Outer yes, Wilds. I can't remember if it's plural. Outer, outer Wilds, know. yes. And okay. definitely not Outer Worlds. Totally different thing. No. Uh, let's do Space for 800. Following a frustrating development cycle on Tales of Fantasia, former members of Wolf Team started the studio Triace and created this long-running RPG series. Fuck. That will be Mike. What is Star Ocean? Star Ocean is correct. Very good. Dan's disgusted by these weeb games. <laughs> <laughs> uh, space for 1,000. In this game, players need to gather pieces of a rocket ship to return the main characters to their home world of Funkatron. Everyone's racing, and it goes to Jeff. What is Toe Jam and Earl? That's correct. I was going to say Bubsy 3D. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bubsy's an alien, huh? I just, the, I just saw co collecting Bubba, spaceship. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Jeff was doing, right? I think I was paying attention. He had to get a spaceship. Right? That's what Pikmin's doing? Oh, it's I know. Do that. <laughs> uh, just, just Bubsy. Let me do name it. Like, of course, of course, Jeff buzzed at first. He's the Bubsy guy. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, gentlemen, listen up. Damn it! I have a guess, but... What is Shovel Knight? Shit! Yeah, oh. shout out to Jake Kaufman. It's gonna say I, that's some Mega Man ass music. Yeah, I, knew, I can I tell it. I can just tell from the style more than like actually recognizing the song. Same. It sounds so sure. much like Shovel yeah. Knight. Uh, name that tune for two hundred. Okay. Stop. <laughs> what you two? Nice. Oh, shame on you two. I just can't place it. That's the moon theme from DuckTales, the best song of the NES era. Mm. Yeah, I mm. wanted to make that go even longer personally. But it's but a good song. It is a very good song. And the final clue in the double Jeopardy round. Why can't I think of it? I can say. Oh, 
Mike. Uh, what is, uh, yeah, Mario Luigi Superstar Saga? Yeah, duh. God, yep, wow. the battle theme yeah. from there. Duh. Jeff, remember when like you were trying Genesis to figure game. out uh, freaking, what, what was it, that song we were trying to figure out the other night? I was like, did is he singing Mario and Luigi's Superstar Saga? That ruins Jeopardy for this month. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, it wasn't that song, but man. I was just listening to that song the other day. I'm like, it was right there. All right, we, okay. okay, Mike, we get it. Just let it out, all right? <laughs> just let hey, it out. Hey, no, I, hey, I no, hey, no. The, false the game is not just, over. I don't know. I don't know. Anything just, could happen. Just do yeah. it. Oh my god. This Everybody, man. this is the end of the double Jeopardy round. All we have is final Jeopardy left where everybody will be wagering whatever they feel like wagering. I can't 8, imagine this contestant will be doing <laughs> up to the maximum that they currently have. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Let's pull ours together, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> do what? Oh, can I? Let's pull yeah. ours together. It'll Let's get us closer. It. Just take yeah. out a loan from the Still bank of Turbo Sean. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> All right. You will be wagering uh, up to your current point total. You'll be sending that to me on Discord. Gentlemen, you know what I'm doing. The, the category <laughs> for Final Jeopardy is Nintendo 64 Publishers. Here's the so, comeback. Quite a bit of information there, but the question doesn't mean it's going to be any easier. Just keep that in mind. And we'll be right back. Okay. The wagers are in. Gentlemen, the clue for Final Jeopardy this month is... While Square infamously never released a game on the N64 after feeling burned by Nintendo, their soon-to-be partners Enix did support the system twice with Wonder Project Day 2 and by handling the Japanese publishing duties on this game. Gentlemen, I will have you DM me your guesses on Discord. You have 30 seconds to do so. Good luck. All right, the wagers are in, the guesses are in, and I will now reveal all for you. We are going from the bottom up, starting with Dan. You're in third place with 100 points on the board. You did have points on the board, keep that in mind. Your guess for the game that Enix published in Japan on the Nintendo 64 was Bubsy. <laughs> uh, not even close. <laughs> Your wager uh, was an attempt at 8,000, which, sorry, Dan, I've got to veto and take your other Damn. option of 100. Damn it. You will be losing everything going down to zero. Losing Fuck. everything, including pride, dignity. Okay. All right. Jesus Christ. I'll forget immediately. It's fine. I'll tell myself I won, and I'll believe it. Just guess was Quest 64, which is also incorrect. Damn. His wager was 2,299. You're going down to $201 points. I can't say dollars because otherwise you'll hold me to that. <laughs> Mike, you're in first place. Very large lead. Confident Mikey is back. Your guess was eat shit, Jeff, <laughs> which is incorrect. You wagered you too, Dan. <laughs> this motherfucker. I hate him so much. Which means like you will not be gaining yes. from losing. When he wins, he's always Ask like this. Brothers, yes. Gentlemen, the answer is Shake Shake. Mischief oh, Maker. Mischief Maker. Oh, that's a good game. game. Hey, uh, my first yeah. guess was a treasure game, right? So I get half points. <sighs> Yeah, give him half point, sure. Whatever. Still, still won't get anywhere <laughs> close, but in the sure we'll get Sin and punishment, I guessed first, then I scratched it out. Yeah. <sighs> Suck it uh, down, Daikatana! What a sore yeah. winner! What a cool. bad winner this man is! He's a sore winner, sore loser. He's always sore. Who would gloat like this? this yeah. Knew yeah. I was going to win from the very person. beginning, starting That's from the terrible. bottom. Now we're here. Don't <laughs> okay. call it a comeback. Oh, I've been Mike, here I think for I years. can server me. Are these Mickey Mouse lines? What is this? Yeah, this is how Mickey Mouse talks. 
Fuck. Yes, it is. All right, everybody. Well, we're going to start winding down here for the evening. But before you go, if you're watching over on YouTube, please make sure to put a like on the video because it helps other people find it later. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of these after they start debuting in the public premiere of season two. And hey, if you want to support us, you like what we do, consider joining patreon.com slash GameS or becoming a member on YouTube. Because that way, in the future, you'll be able to get all the episodes of Jeopardy that we do throughout the year. One month early, you'll get to watch live like everyone else did tonight. And you can even submit clues for the show. If you saw anyone's name written below the clue tonight, that was someone who helps keep the light on or around here. So if you want to be one of the cool kids, again, patreon.com slash game or become a member on YouTube and join the Discord. Okay. Oh Jesus freaking Christ. Uh, anyways. Get us out of here, Sean. There's that note. We're going to finish it. with plugs, Michael. Don't ruin my moment. <laughs> I'm just playing a song. I've, I've been your host for Get the evening. Get those apples out of chat. Stop that. This is my <laughs> moment. <laughs> this is my moment. You shut the hell up. I have been your host for the evening, Sean, Turbo Sean McDowell. You want to find me on the internet, Turbo Sean underscore on Twitter. I'm on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Turbo Sean. We're going to see me playing competitive Pokemon TCG, other Nintendo content, including my uh, Star Fox series playthrough, which is my most recent project. And hey, if you really like Pokemon, Pokemon series playthrough coming soon as of uh, this recording. So maybe go over there, drop a follow if that sounds interesting to you. Special guest for the evening, Mr. Dan Riker. Thank you for being on the show tonight. It was a blast having you here it's, again. It's very fun. I just, you know, I try to be a gracious winner, and I hope I did so tonight. Um, <laughs> of so, course, uh, undefeated world champ <laughs> yes. still. Yes. Thank Frown you for right having me on. Uh, <laughs> uh, I need to check my check the batteries on my buzzer uh, before next time. <laughs> sure, yeah. uh, Right, yeah. right. Uh, I, All right. I well, Dan, if somehow people don't know who you are, why don't you tell them where they can find you on the internet? And shout out anything in particular you'd like for them to check out. Find me at giantbomb.com. Look for the Fire Escape cast on your podcast app of choice. And then actually even tonight, uh, yeah, like uh, Jeff said earlier, I'm going to stream Resident Evil 5 with my sister Kayla. We're going to play for a long time and maybe even beat game. the game. And then, uh, Grub, I think you're going to join for at least part of, uh, or as much as you want. Let me see if I can pan over and see what I got over here. This you see that so wheel? fancy. Holy crap. Yeah, look, look at that this. wheel. That's the Rocky wheel. Next week, before I see Creed 3, all the Rocky <laughs> movies are going up on Amazon Prime. I know it's at a weird angle. Yes. Nice. And so I'm going to spin the wheel, and uh, we're going to have goals and stuff like that. When we hit goals, we're going to spin it and watch whatever fucking Rocky movie pops up, and we will be going for quite a while, I believe. Uh, that rules. I swear to God, if I land on Rocky 5, once or more than once, I'm going to be pissed off. Yeah. But uh, yes, that is the plan. But we're, so we're going to watch it. If it lands, we have to. And also, there's a Frank Stallone documentary on there, too. So we might have to watch that. <laughs> cool. You guessed it. Yes. Take it uh, back. Yeah. That's do, 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 do. Take it back. Awesome. <laughs> Thanks again, Dan. Yes, it was a blast. Mike. Thank you so much. Yes, sir. The winner of the evening. What do you got for us this month? Uh, hey, you should really check out that voicemail dump truck that uh, all three <laughs> of us got to be with Snow Bike Mike on Giant Bomb uh, this week. That was uh, a really, really good time. Uh, <laughs> man, we also had a really fun uh, light club with Song of Six. Yeah, fun week in general. So check all that out. But yeah, uh, you, you know where I am on Jeff's stuff if you're here. But uh, check out my own Twitch and Twitter at Tolkoto, T O L. K-O-T-O. 90s Disney is getting ready for its next episode on Roger Rabbit's uh, cartoon spin over in Disneyland. So is that the name? Yeah, I think it's the name. Uh, I don't know. Chris is writing that episode. So yeah, look out for that on March 1st. Thank you. Excellent. Jeff, Jeff, you're not allowed to do that emote, okay? It's one thing that they all gang up on me. (laughs) I'm gonna. I'm making uncontrollable chaos when I get these three together. I I'm, swear adding, to I'm adding the uh, Mike as Maggie's face as an apple no. to our Discord as a no. way to celebrate his win here today, everybody. Oh my God, Jeff! Please, for the love of God, take us home for the evening. Thank you, Sean. As always, thank you so much. Uh, season premiere. This was free. Next month, it'll be uh, locked behind the paywall. Mm. So uh, you, you'll, you'll be able to get it a month early, of course, if you join the Pay Patreon. Me. Uh, but other, other than that, everyone, you know where I am. Uh, I just want to say thank you for t- tuning in. I really appreciate it. Dan, thank you so much. The last time we were able to collectively kind of take Mike down. Uh, next time, I believe in us. We'll get him next time. We have, last time. we have to. No, time. Jeff, I one last last time. Time. I'll be here with bells on oh, wow. time. Let yeah. me know. Uh, That's right. And uh, go fuck yourself, Mike. I'm going to go eat an okay. apple. Maybe That's going to do it. Thanks, everybody, for watching. That's going to do it for the episode. Y'all take care, and we'll see you next time. Mama did it. 
She's not watching. No, she's <laughs> not. She has no idea. <laughs> no chance. <laughs> She'd be very confused. My mom watches my stuff. 